that's the one thing I've learned also. He's two years and the first year is just such a learning curve. Fuck. And then I thought it would be over after 12 months, ladies. Anybody want to smack me and tell me? <laughs> you dumb bitch! I'm sorry, Amanda. That was very disrespectful. But seriously, us women need to stick together a lot more. Anyway, I'm thinking about so many different things to do my channel because it's mine and have way more fun and focus on the things that I love. And I love bringing joy and love and happiness to you guys' life. Oh, I took the trash can out. And this is my life. I don't know what's going on in it. such a dinosaur there we go you're all clean hey guys I made this like my Poshmark room so far I like it I like the fact that I've um, got like a room for myself for like business office but this section right here, I'm not, like, I would really like this in my bathroom. Like, my vanity, jewelry. So I haven't figured any of that out in my life yet. I'm just now starting to dabble. So just to let you know, it's 8.31 this morning on Monday morning. Oh, I just found my cleaner. That's another thing I'm starting to use, guys, is my stuff back like I haven't really been dabbling and that's kind of my new thing is I have a lot of good stuff I just don't dabble so I just made myself some nice Italian roast Starbucks mixed with a tablespoon of coconut milk and a tablespoon of coconut oil and a sprinkle of cinnamon and mm. I'm now realizing I'm way more of a dramatic person than I ever thought um, military changes you in one way, but also, like, takes you away from your authenticity. And I'm a goofball, so that's what I'm doing. So I'm trying all these new things in the light of Stephanie Miller, my middle name. Um, kind of letting go of Amanda a little bit. I, I, I shy away. I hide. I do, um, nothing, pretty much, um with Amanda and whenever I'm at my higher self, I am completely, I feel like me. Um, so my look for today is not full face, but to work more on my um, assets. So I feel like one of my assets is eyebrows and my lashes, my skin's like all not that great. It was the best when I was on Ideal Protein. That's another thing I'm um, looking into. I only um, put on the Shiseido line, the cleanser serum and eye cream, and then two pumps of the Neutrogena grapefruit salicylic acid, and I put that down my neck. So that's all I've got on right now. All I've got going on today is Boots got... A doctor's appointment at 2 and then I've got pure bar at 620 so I don't want to do a full face but I want to dabble um, and I've got my mirror right here to kind of you know see what I want to work with I've got some baggy baggy um, dark circles not really bags but dark circles um, I'm a mamba and it's just ridiculous I just washed my two beauty blenders here because I'm trying something new. 
I'm noticing that when I put on my Laura Mercier translucent, I'm grabbing like too much with the beauty blender here and I think it's clogging my pores. Um, so I'm trying something new where I'm keeping this one for CC cream, one for powder. I need to go on a brow journey um, because now that the it thing is people like the bushy brows or I'll be honest I don't know how to work my damn brows so I feel like I need to like go to a brow professional to get me some tips or maybe I got to look on YouTube because I feel like I have the it eyebrows but I don't know how to work them so if you guys got any tips, um, link them, tell me, um, tell me down below. One thing that, um, I would like to purchase is, I think it's called brow soap. It's something that I saw someone legit took a spoolie and like, cause I was thinking of using wax or hairspray and someone took a spoolie and put it in there in that like wax thing and it just like popped them all up and I'm like, I need this in my life. So anywho, all right, I'm going to first, what do I want to first do? So this has SPF 50 in it. So should I mix? I've got right here Neutrogena Ultra Sheer Dry Touch Sunscreen. This has been my new thing as well, making sure I apply sunscreen, but I, after trying this for two times, this is legit full coverage, guys. I am not necessarily a full coverage girl. Um, never really needed it, never really cared. A lot of women care a lot about their acne. I'm a person here in this world, and you're going to deal with my acne or not. Um, and by the way, you could wear makeup in the military, but it was kind of pointless um, so I just kind of got used to that as well. So, um, I like this for sure, but I think I want to go more towards the line of a tinted moisturizer. So, um, that's going to be kind of the goal here after I use some of these makeup things. And let's get Monday morning going. So maybe I don't stick with, um, damn, I was going to try and do... CC. This is a skin enhancer. I'm wondering if I should do this Marci Marciel BB cream. And then, seriously, guys, I've been loving this little sample of Super Goop um, CC cream, Daily Correct, broad spectrum, light to medium, self adjusting shade, PA. Plus, 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 like, fuck. Ooh, don't you hate when you have choices? Okay, so we're gonna prime. I have been using Laura Mercier's um, primer, but seriously, I don't know any difference. It doesn't do anything, like, amazing. I went back to my NYX. Studio Perfect Primer, uh, Photo Loving Primer, because this does way more for me than that one. I was just like, um, so excited to try it because it was a designer or a high-end primer. I am not so sure. Um, oh, fuck a duck. I need to go into my bathroom and get the, um, Benefits Erase Paste. Guys, remember in my videos, I didn't really know how to use that concealer. First off, how many years later? Four? Five? I just found out from another woman, because I was having such a hard time working with the shape tape from Tarte, because um, I was following everybody um, doing it with a doe foot applicator, and my eyes or pores or... I, it just looked horrible, guys. Like, it wasn't turning out to be the way that you guys would put it on. It was very, very weird. Um, 
but I just found out from a woman I'll have to link her down below because she gave me another inspiration to try again I, that's another thing that I'm doing in my life is try again you need to give things a good solid six tries before you let your ego kick in and control everything. That's the other thing I'm kind of doing right here is just playing, seeing what's working for me. I love this primer so much. Yeah, so that's pretty much my goal is to figure out my face. I don't play enough. Primer's on. Oh, I gotta go get my Benefit um, uh, so that's a corrector. Sorry if I fucking... It's my brain. It just stops. Um, Benefits Erase Paste is a corrector. I'm about to go get that. And I'll be right back. So how has your guys' 2021 been so far? Mine has been chaotic. But for the better. Um, left 7-11 January 26, 2021. Booyah! Left that job left it gave my week's notice left it good riddance Whew, that was a hard like it wasn't hard like work wise it was hard whole management wise first time with a kid you know in 7-eleven man you guys know how to fucking work us this is a high pace company and it reminded me too much of the military. I was working 12 hour days. Bye-bye. Mm -mm. So this is a race pace, benefits a race pace. Um, I have it in number one fair. Brightening camouflage for eyes and face. So I took a this little amount. Anyway, yeah. I got that much. Um I think I'm gonna warm it between my fingers here yeah there we go to get a little bit nice warm consistency kind of get it to move and then I'm gonna move this right here right on these monster black eye bags so that's something I didn't realize. First off, I, this can correct. I played with this yesterday and fell in love. So this, before my shape tape, worked really well for me. Oh my god. And I was starting to give up on my erase pace, guys, um, until that woman just helped me out. So shout out to you, boo-boo, because -boo, you obviously have done your experiments and I appreciate that because us women need to be guided sometimes not all of us have mothers that can be there thank you for the re-inspiration of my makeup because sometimes you just want to let it things go you're like it doesn't work for me like these other ladies and I wonder if I shouldn't be putting the erase paste on top of my eyes but at this moment I don't care I'm going for more natural and not heavy oh I just like the way it really just right so that's the first step I do I don't take a lot anymore I just make sure that it did its job boop a boo mm, mm, mm. we're gonna go in with some shape tape we're gonna use the Black Beauty Blender. Oh my God, Laura Mercier Mascara is one of my favorites now. So okay, I've got my Tarte Shape Tape in Light Neutral. I went to Sephora and got a shade that was too dark. Um, I probably shouldn't have done that. I've been trying to get away from the dough applicator and maybe use like a brush, but we're going in with this dude. And I hope he does his job. So camera just turned off. So I put shape tape on. I'm going in with this Marcel BB cream and golden glow. 
Uh, do I really want to try this? No, see, it just fell to the fucking floor. It just suicided himself. Why don't I want to do this CZ cream? I think it's because I want to try something new. It's so full coverage. I want something a little bit more sheer. How do we shear it out? Fuck a duck. So the other thing I've been liking is applying it with oil. Now I lost the oil, I think. Mm. Fuck it, right? I think I'm going to use this SPF foundation. It's medium, though. It's so fucking dark. I'm not a medium. I'm like a light. But I'm not letting this foundation go. Ugh, I can't do it. Where is it? Here we go. I've been using this. Oh my god, it's Super Goop! What is this company? Sun Defying Sunscreen Oil SPF 50. <gasps> I wonder if I should pair these two. Fuck, how much do I have left in here? This was such a tiny sample. I really enjoyed this. I would totally repurchase this. I just hope now I've got enough. We're going for it! Yes! Okay, here we go. I hope I have enough. Oh, it's the saddest thing ever. Come on, little tube. Yes! Huh. Poop out some more. 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 I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Oh my god, I'm gonna get it. There we go. Mm. Oh my god, I did it. Oh my god, I did it. That is fucking awesome. I seriously <laughs> hate when things just die. Okay, now I'm gonna do this cool thing and take their fucking, um, Jesus, I'm an idiot sometimes. Super goop, super goop, and I'm just gonna spray like two drops. And now I'm going to spread it. Oh my god, I'm awesome! All right. Oh my god, I'm just so proud of myself. I'm just trying to do new things. Okay. I'm just going to dab this all into my life and hope that I'm doing this as good as I can. Not like I went to beauty school. Oh my god, I'm addicted. I am about to probably make a purchase with Super Goop. Um, if you guys have tried some super goop products let me know because yes I'm impressed I love being impressed okay I'm gonna take a little bit more we're gonna bring it here bring it here I always make sure I get my ears try and bring it down your neck I always then take the bottom and just push. My god, I am um, very happy. I am fairly very impressed. It has gone into my skin very nicely. I think it very it worked nicely well, which is good. I'm not so sure. I feel like it's kind of the wrong shade a little bit. But what you going to do girl, you pull? We blend it. Blend, 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 blend. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I'm not gonna set it right quick. I'm going to go into browse. But I wanna do something different with my brows. Do I have any options? Where's the browse stuff? Is that up in here? Here we are. Okay. So I'm gonna go back and try this CoverGirl Easy Breezy Brow. Now I have it in the color Deep Fonts and it's deep girl like 
I gotta redo my hair black. It comes with this little wand. Very, very little. I'm gonna do me something different here. Do I wanna do this or a spoolie? Ooh, shit just got real. Um, I'm gonna try and put this on a spoolie here. What do you think guys? I like it. As little product as you can, layering is always key. But I'm putting this on my Anastasia spoolie and it seems to be working very nicely. Okay. Boom baby. Brows are on. Now we're gonna go into powder. How are you guys liking your Laura Mercier powder? First off, I'm not crazy about this. Dumping it, putting it in here, I feel like I lose some product. Anyway, taking to the point, I'm gonna set my eyes here. I have been liking loose powder. I just think I'm doing too much. Okay. Yeah, because when I tip it back, I don't know. What about you guys? I just get messes. Face on. So. The next thing I want to just do is get my, I've been using this Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion, the Anti-Aging Long Lasting. Just get a little dollop of that. Remember to, when you're working with your eyes, only use your ring fingers. They are the most delicate. Do not be harsh with your skin, guys. Just don't. That's on. I'm going to go into blush. Ooh, coffee. Have some coffee. Cheers. blush a rooney doonies Where's my blush brush? Oh, here it is. Should I use a new blush brush? I just cleaned my brushes. Blush. Always put your blush on, gotta put your blush on. Okay. I want to go into some contouring bronzer. I need a better bronzer, but I'm okay with using this. I said I wasn't doing a full face of makeup and look at this. Bitch, you using bronzer. I don't wear bronzer as much, but I'm having fun. Bronzer on. I've been really liking this Thrive Cosmetics Brilliant Eye Brightener in Stella. Really nice, like, champagne kind of color. I'm just gonna go up into my brow and really place that there in the brow bone because I like to just showcase there. I like to really go in the inner corner to brighten this up for myself. Then I'm just gonna take it under. Boom, it kind of like fucks with the translucent powder. Anyhow. Get a little bit of the cupid bow. That's not mixing well with the powder. It looks silly. Oh, 
lesson learned, right? Right? It doesn't work well. Interesting. Anyway, mascara. I've been really loving this uh, little sample that I got with that kit, um, the Laura Mercier mascara, and I'm gonna m then mix it with this Benefit Roller Lash sample. I'm gonna go in first with Laura Mercier. And that will be pretty much my look. Yeah. I just love this mascara, guys. I can't even. It just works so good for my lashes. Okay. So this is about two coats of Laura Mercier. I'm gonna go in with one coat of this and maybe another coat of Laura Mercier. Boom. <laughs> it's so good. Okay, now I'm gonna just do these bottoms. Mm -hmm. I need some kind of a lip stick. Boom, baby. So I just went in with Revlon's. It's a Revlon product. This is the finished look. And I'm gonna probably put some dry shampoo in this hair and figure out some kind of cute style or something. Love you guys. Thanks for sticking in and happy Monday!